Today we are going to show you how to make homemade pizza from scratch in the air fryer. So to get started you're going to need two and a half cups of flour. We're using wheat flour but you can use bread flour or white flour, any other flour that you like to make your crust from. Then we're going to need one cup of warm water, a 0.25 ounce pack of yeast, active dry yeast, a teaspoon of sugar, we're going to use the sugar in the raw packets, and you will also need a pinch of salt, that's to make the dough. You'll also need a splash of olive oil. You're also going to need some pizza sauce or whatever sauce you would like on your pizza, some cheese and whatever toppings you're going to need. Also, we're using the pizza liner for the air fryer. If you don't have that, you can just use parchment paper, but you need to cover up those holes so that sauce and dough doesn't drip through into the underside of the air fryer. All right, let's get going. So the first step is you're gonna want to get your cup of warm water and add in your active dry yeast and your sugar. Just whisk that up a little bit and leave it to stand for around about 10 minutes. While you're waiting, you can measure out your two and a half cups of flour into a nice large bowl. Then just take a little break and wait for your yeast. Now what we're gonna do is put our pinch of salt into the flour and then we're gonna pour our uh, active dry yeast mix and water that we just whisked up into the flour and salt. Then we're gonna take a wooden spoon and just whisk it up a little bit and then we're gonna put our hands in there and give it a good knead, probably for about two minutes or so. Once the dough is well kneaded, we're just gonna leave it there for around five minutes just to settle. Then we're gonna divide the dough into three equal parts. Once you've divided your dough into three equal parts, lightly flour a surface and get a roller. Take one of your pieces of dough and roll it out so that it's a little bit bigger than the pizza insert. If you're not using the pizza insert and you're using parchment paper, just roll it out to the desired thickness and size that you want the pizza to be. Once you're done with that, lift the dough carefully off the surface and place it into the pizza insert or into the air fryer on the parchment paper. Now you can just pinch up the sides and make sure that it's all even around the edges. Now this is the fun part. We can start actually making our pizza how we want it. So we're gonna take our sauce and pop that on, sprinkle some cheese on the top, and we are gonna add meatballs onto our pizza. Once you're happy with how it looks, put it into the air fryer and set the air fryer for 10 minutes at around about 380. There's no need to turn or move anything, just leave it to go for the full 10 minutes. Once you're done, take it out and be careful because it's gonna be very hot, especially if you're using that piece insert. I recommend using some oven gloves to take that out. Now all we need to do is pry it loose and put it onto a plate, cut it up and serve. All right guys, that's all there is to it. You're gonna get three pizza doughs out of that mix. So you can make a lot of pizza with it or different sizes even if you want to do that. And uh, yeah, enjoy your pizza, be creative, make something cool, and um, let us know in the comments what you made. If you have any questions, please do leave a comment below, I'd be happy to answer them. And please don't forget to uh, drop us a like and subscribe, and uh, check out all our other videos too. Alright guys, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.